and massive piece of Aloha Stadium is coming down and getting new life. The 1,500 square foot video board that loomed over the north end zone will soon be relocated to the Ching Athletics Complex in Manoa. And while plans for a new Aloha Stadium are still being worked out, this is another step in outfitting UH's on-campus venue. Kyle Chinen reports from Halava. Yeah, it's a win-win-win all the way around. The Aloha Stadium Authority began the process of taking down the video board in the Metal Mecca today, saying the move will be mutually beneficial for both UH and stadium officials. So for us, the benefit is it can be part of our, in a sense, decommissioning of, of the stadium, move it to a place where it can be used. Um, from UH, obviously, it's a huge asset. They're trying to develop Ching Field and make it, you know, a great venue for UH football for the next, you know, five years, say. The estimated cost was not disclosed, but the process is being divided between the stadium and the university, with UH covering the cost and labor of installing the board at Ching Field. It's also a welcome sign of progress on the new Aloha Stadium plan. So this is one step in the right direction. Uh, it's an interim step, obviously. It's going to help UH for the interim, uh, but we want to hopefully see in the near future more and more things coming down so that we can move to the future site. Crews here at Aloha Stadium are dismantling the 1,500 square foot screen and transferring it here to the Clarence T. C. Ching Athletics Complex, where it'll be installed ahead of the Rainbow Warriors 2023 season opener. Then start installation next week. Um, and we're looking to commission it by the end of July. Luke Tingle of Dactronics, the board's manufacturer, says that it still has a lot of life in it and will be put to good use in Manoa. So it's, it's really only got one full year of use. The traditional life is 10 plus years of, of these boards, so um, it, there's plenty of good life left in the board. So it, it, it's, it's going to look fantastic at Shing. I've seen the structure and, and how it fits into what they're doing over there. And for the football team, seeing a piece of their old home digs will hopefully bring back the glory days of the Rainbow Warriors. Trust me, we're just trying to recreate all the same nostalgia and, and, and the same feelings that uh, people had going to Aloha Stadium. You know, having that, that bulletin board and, and that scoreboard, uh, uh, it'll, it'll signify something for us. The Bo's home opener is set for September 1st against Stanford. Kyle Chinen, Hawaii News Now.